Hello, I'm Dr. Inman. Most of you know me. This is a short video on knee replacement and also cartilage rehabilitation using um, the uh, Avant LZ30 laser with the protocol set for uh, knee rehabilitation, cartilage re rehabilitation. There's some x-rays that I'm going to show you here in close-up so you can see this. But 10 years ago, um, I was so bad off on my knee and was bow-legged. I went into my friend who was a top uh, orthopedic surgeon in um, Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. And Bill said, hey, look, at, you need to have a total knee replacement, which, of course, is what orthopedic surgeons do. And I was bone on bone on my left knee, so he replaced it, and he took this x-ray here, which I'll show you an update, and showed me also that my other knee would probably have to have surgery within the next calendar year. So he scheduled me for the surgery on my right knee after he got done taking care of my left knee. The left knee surgery total knee replacement, which you can see here, is was post-operative was so miserable that I figured I'd want to do just about anything I could do to have to avoid having to have the other knee taken care of. So I started using frequency specific laser therapy on that knee to try to regenerate fiber, the cartilage. The cartilage that's regenerated is mostly high, uh, fiber cartilage, but there's a goodly amount of hyaline cartilage in there that allows the knee to be non-painful and also functional. And so as time went by, essentially, um, if it would if it would be sore, I would laser it a couple times. I'd put this device on and go ahead and laser my knee for about 60 to 120 seconds, maybe two, three, four times, and the pain would go away, and it'd be fine for usually for six or seven months. And then the problem would come back again when I'd wrench it, and then I'd go ahead then and do it again. After five years of that, I said, God, I better go back in and have it x-rayed. So I had it re-x-rayed, and it was re-MRI'd, and, and it was noticed that there was no appreciable loss of cartilage in that joint. I was not bone on bone, and so he could not recommend surgery, couldn't figure out quite why. I didn't want to go into the fact that I was using frequency-specific laser therapy because orthopedic surgeons, like myself, believe that a chance to cut is a chance to cure, so he probably didn't want to have a, 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 any of the fact that a, a laser was actually reproducing fiber cartilage, essentially, and so that's fine. Five more years go by, and I laser myself intermittently, wrench my knee again, and it was sore, and it was sore now for about two weeks, so I lasered it, and after two weeks, it was still kind of sore, so I made another appointment. It takes about two weeks to get to see my, my uh, surgeon. By that time, I'm uh, out of pain, and I'm normally function, so he decides to x-ray it again, and he does. Finds out that I still have the same exact space in my joint, a fiber cartilage that I had 10 years ago. Couldn't figure out what it was I was doing. Figured I was probably just sitting behind a desk at a computer terminal my whole life, but that wasn't the situation. I'd been skiing, and I'd been doing all kinds of active things. Um, uh, in my life during that period of time. Let me show you a close-up a little bit of these uh, x-rays so I can justify this particular um, uh, uh, information. Hold on one second. I hope you can see this a little bit better. The original x-ray was taken here 10 years ago and you can see that there's virtually no space left. This is where the the prosthesis is put in there and as you can see there's very little space here in the joint and then five years later this x-ray was taken I'm just showing you the right leg showing you that in fact the space is exactly the same and then ten years later the space here is exactly the same and so what we've been able to do is prove through the lack of degeneration of that disc or that uh, joint uh, that we're able to regenerate fiber cartilage uh, the fiber cartilage generated by the frequency specific protocol. We have a tendency to use a, a protocol called fracture nonunion, which actually works particularly effectively for that particular rehabilitation for fiber cartilage. There are uh, ACL frequencies, there are frequencies for other joints, etc. All of them contain the, the frequency sets and the frequencies that direct fiber cartilage rehabilitation. So in comparison, these spaces here, here, and here, 10 years ago, 5 years ago, and last month, have not decreased at all in size because the fiber cartilage is still viable and still functioning and keeping my joint from tearing itself apart. I should have been bone on bone within a year of 10 years ago. Five years ago, I should have been bone on bone, and I should have been bone on bone last month, but I'm not because of this laser. The bottom line is this. 
you have two knees. The chances that in your 90 years on this planet you're going to have to have a surgical problem or intervention to that knee is probably 100%. This device actually allows you to be able to regenerate. The cartilage actually, because of continual pressure and degeneration of those particular joints, it is worth its weight in gold. This device costs $6,950, which is probably much, much less than the deductible of the surgery that you're going to have even if you have Medicare. Um, plus also it takes care of shoulders, ankles, uh, elbows, and other joints of the spine and the back, uh, essentially. And is probably in, in uh, something that you should be using in, on yourself, your family, and also certainly in your practice. If you're standing and walking around in a clinic, your knees are going to go away before you're 70. If you're um, crazy enough to jog or run, essentially, you're probably going to have to stop in your mid-50s, whereas you don't have to do so uh, if you utilize the fiber cartilage regeneration aspect of this particular laser. If you have any questions about this laser, how it's applied to conditions in the human being for uh, joint rehabilitation, contact me at area code 208-640-3430. 208-640-3430 and I'll send you a bunch more information uh, on the uh, 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 research that we've done in joint rehabilitation using just this instrument. This instrument basically treats for 60 to 120 seconds, uh, yeah, three times a week for two or three weeks usually solves the problem and may have to be repeated every six months essentially. It's easy to do and um, it's something that we have found is revolutionary as far as its ability to treat aches and pains in joints, particularly the knees, essentially in the human being, dog, cat, the horse, etc., etc. Thank you for your patience and have a great day.